What's up guys, welcome back to our channel, we are Future Goalkeeping and today we're going to be taking a look at the One Sport Legend Goalkeeper Gloves. Let's go! Firstly, let's take a look at the most obvious feature of these gloves. They can be used strapless but do come with attachable straps. So let's test them out and see whether they are good enough to be used strapless. As soon as I put the gloves on, the first thing I noticed was the space in the wrist sleeve of the glove, which causes the glove to bunch up when I move my hand as it isn't tight to my wrist. This can be very annoying since it will feel like the wrist entrance is moving up and down your arm and the glove is restricting your hand movement. So now let's put the strap on and see if it helps. The strap is short and wraps around the wrist once, leaving no excess strap. With the strap on, the wrist sleeve does feel tighter and more secure, stopping the movement of the wrist entrance. Moving on to the rest of the glove, it has a 4mm super soft latex on the palm, but this isn't what I want to talk about in relation to grip. Inside the glove, One Sport have added a really cool and interesting feature to help when gripping onto the ball. In each finger there are internal silicon strips which feel like suction cups to make it easier to grip and hold onto the ball. The glove also has a tight negative cut fit and an extended wrist sleeve to really give a second skin feel. Because of this and the internal silicon strips in the fingers, it makes catching and holding onto the ball much easier due to the control you have over it. Overall, I really do like these gloves. I think the internal silicon strips in each finger are such a cool idea and the tight fit is really nice. Personally, I would choose to use these gloves with the strap on just for the added tightness and safety in the wrist sleeve. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think of these gloves in the comments and I'm really interested to see your opinion on the internal silicon strips. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next video.